Hello, welcome back to the STM32 UI interfacing series. So in this, in the last video, we already done a coding for transmitting data using UART communications. So in this session, we would like to write a coding for transmit and receive data using UART module. So let's look at the example 4D. So in this example, we want to transmit data and receive it back. That is the user type a character in a visual terminal and press the enter. The same character will transmit back to the visual terminal. Okay, as usual, we start the coding with writing include stm32 f10x and then continue with the function declaration. So in this program, we have three function. So additional one compared to the last coding. So this, we add a that is we add a usat read function. So this is a usat read function, this new function. Okay, in the main function, we start by declare the variable character that you want to receive. Then we initialize the UART as user. So in the while loop, we start to read the character entered by the user. So we write syntax ch ch the is equal to usat read. Okay, we read a character from the serial com. So it go to the usat read function. So this is a usat read function. So this coding will read the character from the serial com. And then if we want to return back the same character, so you write the coding, you start to write character. So this you return back the character that we just start in the visual terminal. So you have uh, uh, two function for you start, you start write. So this to write and then you start read. So to read the character. <coughs> okay, let's, uh, so in this function, it will monitor monitor the rx and e bit in the status register so rx and e stand for receive receiver not empty is bit 5 bit 5 at a status register so we need to monitor this bit uh, to make sure that all the data have arrived before we send it to the data register using instruction written inside data register when we call finish the uh, usat read function is back to main program and then we run the, the function usat write chain ch character so this go to the right and then display the same character uh, that is read from the serial com okay let's compile the coding and uh, run the simulation Okay, click at the virtual terminal and you run the click at the virtual terminal and then press the character. For example, I press the A so it will transmit back the character A to the virtual terminal. When I press the character G, it will transmit back the character G. I press the Z, it will transmit back the character G. Okay, for exercise, so you adjust the or modify the codings in exercise for D and adjust modify the coding so that when when the UI transmit back the next character it receives. For example, if we type A, it will return back B. And if we type the character K, it will return back the L. 
okay, it will return back the next character. So that is uh, the exercise for uh, this video. Okay, uh, I think that's all for the your transmission. So see you again. Thank you.